What's up guys, Tim Stoddard here, vlog number two. I'm off to a good start. I mean, <laughs> it's my second day doing this, so I got a long way to go, but nonetheless, I'm committed to do it. I, I woke up this morning. I don't even know what, where this thought came from. Um, so what am I getting at? All of my online companies are basically, um, like media based. I don't sell any physical products on my businesses or on any of my websites. And at one time, uh, I'm still 15% owner in a clothing company that I started and grew and then kind of sold off. But at one time, uh, the, my t-shirt company was like a big, a big part of my, uh, my day to day life. And there is something very uniquely satisfying about like, the actual sale of a thing, you know, like here's that money, here's that thing. And even though it's all done online, um, there is something about like that dopamine hit and that adrenaline rush that, that I kind of miss. So, uh, what am I getting myself into? I have a ton of books around the house. I, I read every night. I'm an avid reader. I always have been. I love going to the bookstore and I love buying actual books. I've, I've still never read like an ebook or, or a Kindle or even listen to audio books. There's something very like meditative to me about the process of like turning pages or whatever. So, so what I'm getting at is I, I have a ton of books lying around the house and I'm, I'm thinking about adding like a used bookstore to my website. So I don't know if I want to just add it like as an extension of timstods.com or if I want to start it as another website or even if I, I want to do it at all, frankly. Um, I just don't know if it would be worth it for me to like pull my, my time away. But then there's the other side of me that says like, what else am I doing on the weekends? Like it's so easy. I would only sell them one at a time, you know? I, I'm not trying to turn this into like a real business. It's just if I finish a book, I always put the book of the week on the newsletter. I read about one book a week, right? So if I finish a book every week and I have it on the newsletter, why not buy it and then like sell it back to the world at like a extremely discounted price, give somebody the chance to have like this really great book um, for not a lot of money and I can not have huge piles of books in my house. I don't know, man. Um, I have a problem in my life with, with acting on every idea that I have. And I gotta be mindful of that. So I'm just kind of toying with some ideas this morning on like the cost benefit between having this side little hobby that's probably gonna be a lot of fun and on all of those moments that I spend taking pictures and flipping books, could I be sending on some of my other projects like Year Boulder especially. Yearboulder.com is like a, is very high in my priority list right now. All right, vlog number two, wrap. See you tomorrow, peace.